Hey there, my name is Tim and welcome to the channel. When most people think of using their GoPro camera, they think of using it for action-packed events or things which are high octane, big energy events like rafting or cycling or maybe even hiking through a canyon. But did you know that you can also use your GoPro to take rather fantastic selfies using the GoPro timer? Well, you can and it's super simple to do and in this video, I'm going to show you how. Okay, so once we turn on the GoPro, then we want to press on the mode button on the left hand side until we get the photo setting. Once we've done that, then we press on the photo button at the bottom of the screen. It's going to open up a new menu. Press the pencil next to the word photo at the top of the screen and you will see in front of you all the photo options. Now one of the options there on the bottom left is timer. So we're going to click on that. Now the default setting for timer is off, but there are two other settings that we can use. If you use the slider and put it to the middle, that means you set the timer for three seconds. And if you slide it all the way to the top, that means that your timer setting will be for 10 seconds. Press the mode button one time to take it back to the main screen. Next press the shutter and then on your screen you'll see a countdown timer appear, in this case from 10 to 1, with a little red light flashing in the top left hand corner to tell you that the timer has been activated. Once the shot's been taken, you can check it out by swiping upwards with your pointer finger on the back screen. And this is how it looks from the front. After you press the shutter, you'll see the numbers counting down on the front screen and you'll see the red light flashing just above the screen. And it does quicken as it gets closer to taking the photograph. And that's it, you've just taken another super selfie. A great way to get easy access to the timer and the other GoPro photo features is by using shortcuts. Press the photo button, then press the white pencil, just like before. Once the next menu appears, swipe all the way down to the bottom until you find shortcuts and you'll see four options that you can utilize. The four default settings of lens, zoom, timer and output are listed under the shortcuts heading, along with their location on the main photo screen. To change a setting, simply tap on the icon's location on the main photo screen. A new menu will appear and on the right hand side you'll see a slider which if you move it up and down, it will give you the list of options that are available. When you've made your selection, simply press the mode button one time to take you back to the main photo screen. Now if you press the upper left icon, it will open a slider with the timer options. From zero to three seconds and 10 seconds. How good is that? So there you go. What did you think? How easy was it to use your GoPro with the timer to take perfect selfies of high quality every single time? If you love GoPros as much as I do, then you're going to want to check out this video over here next. It's packed chock-a-block with heaps of great information on how you can get the most out of your action camera. The rather awesome GoPro. Hey, thanks for watching. Really appreciate your company. And until next time, I will see you later.